And the British singer Dua Lipa says she's honored to receive Albanian citizenship in a ceremony hosted by the Albanian president in Tirana. I want to tell you now about how Dua Lipa has received Albanian citizenship in a ceremony hosted by the Albanian president in Tirana. The singer was born in London, but her roots go back to Kosovo. Wendy Urquhart reports. I got you. Dua Lipa is famous all over the world and her disco pop songs have won her a clutch of awards, including three Grammys, two MTV Europe Awards and six Brit Awards. Her family are Kosovan Albanians who fled to London in the 1990s and returned briefly in 2008, but Dua Lipa has never forgotten her roots. On Sunday, she was welcomed to Tirana by President Baram Begay, who presented her with Albanian citizenship and said she'd made her country proud. It is a special pleasure today in the presidency to welcome the greatest artist Dua Lipa and her family. I say a great artist, a simple girl whose fame is known all over the world, but she has given us the greatest pride. Dua Lipa grew up listening to David Bowie, Bob Dylan, Radiohead and The Police, mainly thanks to her dad who's also a singer-songwriter, and she was inspired by Madonna, Gwen Stefani and Blondie. But getting her Albanian citizenship was clearly a precious moment for the singer. It is a great honour for me and my family to have an opportunity to represent my country and people. This girl is no wallflower. She has frequently spoken out against sexism in the music industry and is an avid supporter of the LBTQ community. Dua Lipa has clearly found her potion for success. She's topped the charts all over the world, modelled for several top fashion companies, featured on the cover of numerous magazines and even designed her own clothes. Now she's officially Albanian too. Wendy Urquhart, BBC News. Isn't she fantastic? One of my favourites. And that's it from us.